As the world celebrates uh, the longed for good news with the vaccines in their final stage and results being announced, there are imminent challenges of distribution that still remain. Among the many hurdles, the most crucial is the storage of the vaccine. Pfizer's vaccine candidate needs to be stored at minus 70 degrees Celsius, for which specialized cold storage units are needed. And the public health resources are stretched thin after nearly a year of pandemic response. But there are some companies that have started the production of ultra-cold freezers. Germany's binder which makes specialized cooling equipment for laboratories, has ramped up production of refrigerated containers needed to transport the vaccines. Binder is producing a unit that will reach the ultra-cold temperatures needed to ship the Pfizer vaccine. We have inquiries from the whole of Europe. Everybody slowly realizes that they need a cold chain system, else at least the RNA vaccines can't be used. Our telephone lines are running hot, and that is good news. The bad news is that we are still in the middle of a huge economic crisis, and so our normal business, which is among others, the automotive branch is suffering. No COVID-19 vaccine has been approved for either emergency use or general use. Pfizer only recently submitted data to the U.S. Food and Drug Administration for emergency approval. 